What's up, Gadget Squad? When I first got this journal and it was time to set the three-digit password, I was like, I'm not writing this down. I mean, why would I? It's not like I'm going to forget three digits, <laughs> but I'm good at surprising myself. So here we are. If you found this video and you want to know how to recover and update your passcode, here's how. As of this very moment, I'm just like you since I don't know the passcode, but I went ahead and set it to 000 to start us off. I recommend doing this under the light and angling the book so that you can view it just like I am right here. Now, pay attention to the grooves here. This is what you're gonna wanna align your passcode digits with. Now focus on the metal cylinder in between the gear and this brass part of the journal. Also notice how smooth it looks. Now, keep focus and turn the gear until the cylinder exposes a groove. So we're gonna keep turning it until it's not smooth anymore. All right, still nothing, still smooth. And there it is, the little groove that we were looking for on the number four. So right now we'll leave the number four set and we're gonna go on to the next gear and keep turning it. Remember, it still looks too smooth. We wanna see that groove. And there it is again. So we have two down. We just need one more to go. All right, you know the drill. Keep turning. And there it is. So this right here is what you want to see. You want to see all three grooves lined up with each other, how it is now. Okay, so we recovered my last password, which was 444. And if you want to open it, all you have to do is go over to the switch and push it down towards the left. And it'll open, as you see here. Let's do that again. Push to the left. For anyone who's curious, I got this Ty Fossey B6 journal from Amazon. It comes with a vintage brass lock. As you see here, it has a pen holder too. The cool thing about the paper is that it's refillable, so you can swap the pages, which are ruled with lines. Below, you see that it comes with a ribbon bookmark too. This one comes in different colors, and Ty Fossey journals come in many different styles, but I'll post a link in my description for anyone who's interested. Anyway, let me show you how to change the password once you actually know it. Okay, step one, set your password in line. Step two, push the switch to the right and hold. Step three, while holding, update the password. Step four, let go of the switch to set the password. Step five, test the new passcode by pushing the switch to the left and opening. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna test it a little further by changing the digits and resetting the passcode to make sure it opens again. And there it is, all confirmed. And like always, thanks for watching. Peace.